Hi everyone, I'm Kiralis and welcome to episode 1 of a brand new series in a game called Timberborn. And if you love beavers, this game will be absolutely up your damn. It has been out for quite some time with overwhelming reviews and feedback and since we are back in the whole like colony city building genre then why not play some Timberborn and now is also the perfect time to play it because there has just been a new update and I will link the full update 5 trailer in the description below this video however it does contain tons of new quality of life improvements we have new features and new content like for myself this is all brand new but for some seasoned players you might be like ooh, that's a nice new feature and also a huge Shout out to Mechanistry, the developers and publishers of Timberborn, for sponsoring the first episode. So please make sure to check out the link in the description. And without further ado, let's just dive right into it. Like a beaver. Tee hee, tee hee, a joke. So we have two factions to choose from. We have the Folk Tales, or we have. Come to the Iron Thief. And this is not unlocked. To unlock, reach average well being of 15 while playing Folk Tales. So Folk Tales it is. Easy going, but hard working. Folktales are expert farmers, they respect nature and it rewards them with plentiful bounties. Their motto, comfort, food and sturdy wood. <laughs> Let's go. And I started a tutorial on this map, the waterfalls. Beautiful map, by the way. And the ones with the leaf are beginner friendly. And since this is pretty much the first time I'm playing it, we maybe will choose one of those. Plains or lakes? This, I think, no. I think this looks better than the plains, right? This is flatter, I guess, but no, let's go with lakes and let's be all happy about it. Uh, easy, normal, hard and cast. No, you know what? Let's go normal. Just, just, just like that. Don't judge me. Hmm, what do we call this? I mean, we can't go beavers without beaver tongue. That's lame, Kuralis. No, I think, <laughs> yeah, it's a little bit lame, but uh, no, it's perfect. For us, it's going to be absolutely amazing. And ladies and gentlemen, say hello to our little beavers. We have eight big beavers and four tiny beavers. <laughs> Look at this guy. Papa Beaver just chilling about. And I believe this is the district building. So anyhow, I did start a tutorial on the waterfall map, but then I thought like, let's do everything on, on episode one, even the tutorial. I mean, how hard can it be? Right? Hopefully nobody's gonna die. And in case they do, pause the game. So what do we have? There's quite plenty to the game. We have paths and structures, like platforms, we have suspension bridges, we have landscaping, storage buildings, district management, we have housing, we have water facilities, food, wood, metal, power buildings, <laughs> gravity better even, we have science, we have well-being, like campfires. So I didn't really reach this far in the tutorial. Rooftop terrace, teeth grindstone, that is amazing. We have showers, ladies and gentlemen, medical, beds, contemplation spots. We have Lido. <gasps> that is, that is kind of cool. Herbalist, we have Agora, we have a carousel and so on and so on. And my favorite thing is obviously decorations. We have different roof types, <laughs> beaver statue. <laughs> I'm going to be spending so much time decorating stuff, but uh, I will do a tutorial on camera with you guys and the first thing we need to do is get some lumberjack flags going and that is in this category and we have a forest up here which we can reach because of this makeshift staircase and we also have a forest down here i don't think we, i don't think we can reach this side as of now because we don't have the bridges unlocked right hmm thing is can we liberty without you can we do can we maybe just do platforms instead of the bridges because they are a little bit more expensive i think that this might be a thing well obviously we don't have the science points but it's so much cheaper using the platforms than using the suspension bridges and such but we're not there yet so what would a professional timberborn players do well i'm not one of those so i will do some pre-planning and build some roads now you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna do well-being because 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 why not don't judge me okay I mean, the beavers, they deserve a little bit of a campfire, I guess. Let's do, let's do this. I'm gonna have one over here. And how big was the teeth grindstone? Could have, okay, just one for the moment, just one. Then one more campfire like this, maybe? I don't think we need to build them, because I think we can just pause them temporarily, so we don't waste any resources. Not that I have any, besides a little bit of food. 
we have 130 berries. That's all. That's all we got. We don't have even, even have any water, but we're going to have beautiful campfires over here. And by the way, how big is the housing? So I guess the housing is about... I guess they can be tweaked like a sow. So let's do... What do we do, Corrales? I don't know what we're going to do. We will do paths all the way around this to begin with. So we're going to have a path going like this. That goes to here. 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 I mean, what would a Corrales settlement be without paths, right? For those who've been around, you know I need to surround my stuff and build everything pretty. But it's also like, you know, we need to squeeze in as much as we can in a tiny space, right? Let me just resume the gameplay. Will they build those? Okay, so road is pre-built, but that is not. Okay, perfect. And then we're gonna get some housing. And the more we have, the more baby beaver making is gonna be, right? Inhabitants free of those. So there's a little family. So we can have... Hmm. Do we have... The cool thing about this is that I've seen... As soon as there's a building which says solid, we can place other buildings on top of it. And we can just grow it. And but like eventually we have like staircases going up to different buildings and such. We can make wonders of this, okay? But this is just episode one and this is this is for trial and error, I guess. Something like a soul. Okay, don't worry. We're not going to be building them. This is just for future. So we do have like a solid layout and we don't have to destroy everything and move everything within like the next five, ten minutes. That goes like this, that goes like here, and here, and here. And then we can make staircases in between here, going up on different elevations and such. But now we just want to have those points, the lumberjack flags. So let's do... How big is the range on those guys? Okay, so the further this way, the better the coverage, I guess. But for the moment, I'm not really going to care about that that much. I'm going to place two of those guys over here. We'll extend a path going down here temporarily. To catch those over here as well. Those trees, that is. Uh, where was that? That was here. Lumberjack flag. Perfect. And get two of those locations here as well. It's going to be a lot of lumberjacks for the moment in the community. You guys doing your thing? There we go. Amazing. Those are built up. They are connected to the paths. And now we just need to mark some trees for cutting. And that would be this over here, right? Perfect. Um, let's just drag out this area like this. And maybe in further up here for the future. And then we just do the same over here. I'm not sure this is this is the, the wisest move to deforest the whole area. Because do those guys... What is that exactly? Lumberjack flag. That's pretty much just a flag for guys to chop down trees. Plant trees and bushes. Require building forester. And how do I acquire that guy? I need to unlock that with points, which I don't currently have. The beavers are beavering. I'm a little bit afraid that every single tree is going to be gone, and I'm not going to have enough points to get the forester going. But but we'll see. Ha! Look at them. They are beautiful. So next up on the agenda is to get the water pump going, and that would be the water category. And la 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 la, pumps and filters, water, beavers, drink, bad water contamination slows down its pumping speed. Okay, so there is bad water now in the game, and what is that? That is ruins and scrap metal. I believe this is the bad water, is it? Bad water source. And this is remains from, from the human civilization. The only thing they left <laughs> was badness, I guess. But I think, like, I think this destroys everything in its path. So we need to be careful with that. However, if I would remove a blockage over here, like, this is normal water. So if I would remove that, that would be flowing downstreams, making the whole area green. Or maybe not. I'm not sure how this works yet. Tips, tricks, and suggestions, everybody. More than welcome in the comment section, okay? But anyhow, so let's get this pump going. It's going to be situated somewhere... Maybe like this. That is kind of like in the city center of everything, right? So let's get this going over here. And I know some people will be face palming because we will be demolishing more berries. But, but I don't care. I just want to have pretty roads. You might be, oh, Kiralis, you idiots. What? Well, this is what it is. 
I need to increase the priority, so please get rid of those berries. They sound so sad as well, and I believe we have well-being minus 11. First and shelter. I guess first is going to be... First is going to be the first, because, yeah. Let's increase the priority on this, and also workplace priority like that. Is that how we do it? Oh, that's kind of nifty, okay? This is something I wish every single like, city builder game had. Because I believe that you can increase the priority on building this, right? So that's going to be top priority. And then once this is built up, you can just increase that straight off over here. Because usually when, I build, like, when I'm playing in games like this, sometimes I tend to forget about that when the building is fully built up. And now this priority is maxed. <laughs> so how... Oh, you go into this building to drink? Or how does this work? Okay, next up it would be a getter flag. Oh, so they go all the way here to drink. Get rid of this berry bush, because we're going to have a beautiful bridge going across here. Will we? Yeah, one day, I hope. I think, you know, 65 logs, I think we can slowly resume stuff. Like, they will have a campfire, for example. Let's maybe get some housing up and running as well. That is just 12 logs per each. And then they're going to be loving me. Right? Well, hopefully. Okay, let's get a few extra build up. Just for the baby making. Just for the baby making. Like this. Are we pumping? I think we are. I'm just thinking. Oh, look at that. That's adorable. Look at them just sitting by the campfire. See? Who's the good mayor? Well, obviously, I am the good mayor. But we need beavers, we need water, everybody's thirsty, people are dying left and right, however, the, the, the well-being has gone up a little bit. I mean, first is still an issue, but what, what can a man do? Please build this farmhouse, just 25 logs. So we have carrots, uh, stop it. So we have carrots, we have sunflowers, potatoes, wheat, cattail. Okay, I guess we can't do them yet. And then we have spider rock. Or spider dock. Okay, so I guess those... Is that water? Oh, it's an aquatic plant. So that goes into, into the river over here. That is built up. But I guess they choose for, for us the carrots. So carrots it is. I um, will delete those over here. I know, I know, I know. Maybe not the wisest idea. But, but I guess later on, we can plant the blueberries. So those are going to be removed... Okay, we need more carrots than that, Kralis. Yeah, 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 no. Let me just get a little bit of extra space over here. Like... This, maybe? This is how we do it. Well, is it really? Yeah, it is. Boom. Perfect. That is it. So now we need a large pile. Large pile to logs, small tanks, and tanks to water. Okay. Easy peasy, a lemon squeezy. And that is in storage, right? So we need to have ourselves one of these. And what is that for, by the way? That is for logs. So I guess the most logical way would be to place it up here, right? No cruelty. Well, obviously it is, because there, there's some logs coming from. Me might not have been. I'm, I'm kind of thinking, like, maybe those guys over here, they will carry the logs into this instead. And, uh, and that is going to be, what is the logs? That is the logs, right? Yeah, perfect. And then we need three of those guys. And the question is like, do we place them over here or do we place them within the community itself? Because what I do believe, like, I mean, they, they will come by here and drink straight from those guys, right? So let's do maybe one, two, and three. And let's assign Vato, Vaso, and Vatten. Hmm... If I extend that road... Okay, do, 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 it's, it's gonna be good for us, okay? Uh, remove this resource, this resource, and I guess a few of those. We won't have the trees over here either way. Uh, and let's see here. This water thing in my jiggy, can I place it now when the path is over here? Indeed I can. Like a so, like a so. Do it. Maybe we resume this guy. We, no, 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 no. Before everybody dies... I, I need to make sure they have water at least. And food. That's kind of like the top priority. Well, not for me. Can you guys remove this, please? Okay. 
Amazing. And now that this could be operational, we're going to plant some more carrots over here to make it pretty and nice. And we will have two of those guys. We have beautiful housing being built up. That is done. Next objective. Build two medium warehouses. Set one to carrots, one to berries. Okay, so how big are those guys? They are about three tiles. Okay, so that could be a commitment. Or maybe even... There are so many possibilities over here. So let's do one and two. So one will be... What did we say? Berries and one will be for carrots. Why did we place them so far away from... Stop it. Stop it. I'm gonna I'm gonna cancel the operation over here because I mean that's kind of like unlogical. The berries are over here, so we could pretty much have it over here, and the, and the carrots are over here, right? So so yeah, so get this on carrots and this on berries, and you just remove that, and everybody's gonna be happy. What are you guys complaining about? Oh, food. Yeah, that might be a little bit of an issue for us. How is this? Okay, so it's almost harvest season, right? So we should prioritize the carrots over here. Am I worried? Nah. A little bit, I guess. We did stabilize the water situation a little bit. However, we do have a huge issue with, with, uh, with food now. But hey, we have a beautiful campfire. That, that's always something, right? Next on agenda, lodges already done. Perfect. Uh, build an inventor. Okay. That's going to be our science points. And those required to get this guy, the forester. So we need 60 points. So let's maybe get the one or two of those guys. How big is this? Not that big. Hmm. Should we do... Uh, should we do two of those? Uh, let me see. F. Okay, let's pause one. And build one. We'll see what happens. I'm still afraid of the res uh, the resources, especially of over here. Maybe get a little path. Stop it. Uh, yeah, chop that down ASAP. I will remove. Uh, do, 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 do. Talking to myself very awkwardly. I will remove those. I'm gonna extend this path. you happier than ever. Well, I think I'm doing something right. Food situation <laughs> t t terrible absolutely terrible but water is amazing the inventor is up and running perfect you guys demolish that do i need to demolish that to build a road let me see here can i build a road i can okay so i'm gonna build a road like i saw this is gonna be turning to about here and i will build one more of those lumberjack flags just here and they should be able to chop down this whole region and i will pause this guy here temporarily this is how we do it is, is this great no it's not i'm super afraid food is going up though so, so yeah we should be fine next up water wheel okay so let's just see here it is water dependent, so obviously we need some water. So we could place this over here. What is that? The power wheel. <laughs> is this like a huge hamster wheel? <gasps> oh, that's amazing. What else do we have? Power shafts, windmills. But the agenda says this guy. So let me just... Gee. Let's say we would have it over here like that, one next to that. Can we have them across going? No, we can't. Hmm. Uh, pause this. Is there, a, is there like a right or wrong to this whole thing? The water just spins that about... No, we should be fine. And then we just connect this guy up with... No, we can't. Is there anything else? T intersection, power shaft, you know? High voltage. Danger. Danger. Okay, so that is that is not how we do it. Question is, can we put that on a platform? We'll see in the future, okay? Not there yet. No way! 
Look at this guy. We got points. We got points. Ladies and gentlemen, we got points. Let's research this guy. Boom. Science points. Researched. And we can put him down somewhere. Maybe just here. Yes. Perfect. You, you just believe. Next up is to get the lumber mill. Because of what? Okay, so this guy required planks. And uh, da, 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 the lumber mill makes planks. But does require electricity. Okay. Uh, we have we have a situation. This is this is not great. We need seven planks. Okay, those are removed. And let's get the lumber mill in here. Okay, makes the planks. Oh, that's something I can do. Don't do it. I will. I will do it. Like I mean, this is dirt cheap, right? It's just six logs, and this is gonna be taking all the planks. Like, in my opinion, we have a beautiful little community growing. It's done. Next up is just to plant 20 pines. Well, obviously, we're going to plant more than 20 pines. So, Burge gave us one log, nine days. 12 days, two logs. 24, four. So, I guess they kind of go hand in hand. But for the moment, I think I'm just going to go with the pines. Mainly because of the turtle says so. And I think this will be a speedy approach for us. What's the range on this? Okay, so we can still go about two more rows this, this way. Like that. Perfect. I think... I'm not sure anything's gonna be growing over here, but I'm gonna plant them and we'll see what happens. Maybe even up here. All the way here. And here. And here. Can't do that. And, 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 and here. And a little bit of here. Like, if this works out, somebody's gonna be happy. Will it work out? I, I don't know. Like, I don't think here is gonna be a big success. Because of the ground. Oh, no. Like, the whole river just dried out. Because of the drought, Corrales. I do believe there's... Okay, so there's water over here. So if we were to dig this deeper, maybe somehow, how does one? Uh, is there like a science thingy, Majigi? Refinery? Bot part factory? Bot assembler? I, 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 I want those. A shower would be cool. But yeah, no. The bed is... The dying... We can make this. Not that we need food per se, but there's still one day remaining of the drought, and there's still berries, so we can research that, the little platform, build that platform, come across, or go across. Uh, how are we doing the logs? Did we just use all the logs to make planks? Well, seven planks, to be precise, so it's not like, wow. Will we survive this? I think we have survived our first drought. We don't have any water remaining, but it should be ending... Like, like now, please? Ooh. So what does that mean? That we survived? Yeah, I know, but... Oh, okay. So this over here is a water source. So that's gonna be flowing, overflowing this and going all the way down. Okay, so we know. We, we need more... We need more water tanks and pumps and pretty much everything. Let's unlock storage. Uh, nope. Over here, let's get the platform going. <laughs> Why did I lock that? I don't know. Don't, don't judge me. I'm hoping this is going to work out. Because that means I could do this. Get this extended. Get those berries going. That, that's, that's what I'm hoping for at least. And I guess we could just do... can have tons of pumps on this side. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen. We have survived. I repeat. We have survived. Boom! Okay, so now I'm supposed to be self-sufficient. Which... Which I kinda am. Maybe. Everybody's super thirsty. Are we doing this? Are we planting trees over here? 
The only thing is that it takes such a long time for them to grow. So that is a huge downside. But however, if I can manage to get across over here, having them build up, um, it's going to require quite a bit of logs. But if we can do that, we can make use of all those trees over here in the far end. Okay, so this is something we might need. A hauling post. Haulers assist workers within a district in carrying goods, greatly increasing their productivity. Yes, please. Um, we're here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that'd be perfect. Like this, like that. Let's pause this construction on this guy. And maybe, like, the thing is that, like, I'm building a lot of stuff, and I don't think we've got enough, uh, enough workforce. While we wait on the logs, we could maybe get some planning going. Um, I don't want to build stuff, but let's say we would do... Can we unlock a staircase, by the way? Yes, we can. Unnecessary, but it's a thing now. Could have those... Okay, pause the game. Get those built up like this. Pause. Pause. Mm, we can have this, the same on this side. Pause the game. Pause those, I guess. And then... No and then, and then, no and then. Hmm. Could I have something like this, maybe? Yeah, yeah, yeah. stop this. Uh, pause this, build, pause this, pause those, those. Do the same on this side. Don't want to build them yet. But this could be a thing. And then we have those singleton houses. Single beaver tons houses over here, like that. And then this goes up to a new platform, new roofing. Huh. That is for the future, okay? We'll see how this looks. But I think that might, that might be a thing. Oh my goodness, 95, 96. It's happening. Please chop them down. And please build those up. ASAP. Do I need to do paths on those? Oh, I do. Okay. Does it still say? Okay, it's too far from a district. Too far from a district. I guess that works. Huh. We'll see. Are we chopping? Yes! Well done, really chopping. But they are popping up and they are being done. Okay, so this is... No, no, no! How are we doing on those? Okay, this needs to be done. Because what we need, we need all those berries. And that is really quickly. Will this work? Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I believe in this, okay? So what do we need over here? We need one of those lumberjack flags. That's going to be the whole region over here. This is just temporarily, okay? And then we will need a gatherer here as well. Boom. Perfect. Uh, guys, two more planks. One more plank. Yes! Is this done? Oh my, oh my. We've made it. Just before the drought hits as well. Okay, so we just need this. I'm not sure this is out of range. I don't think it is. Is that oak? <sighs> That is eight logs. Okay, I'm kind of happy. We could resume this, the, the hauling post. You guys are still chopping. That is perfect. How's the range on this? Oh, you still have a few trees to chop down. Those oak trees, though. I mean, eight. Eight logs each. I think we need to plant quite a few of them somewhere. In, in, in the future, that is. I guess, since they're gonna be built up, we could pretty much just get those pumps situated. So we're gonna have one, two, and three. Uh, perfect. And they will have a huge crop field over here. So carrots are four days, which is, which is great. Sunflower, potato. <sighs> the 
Like, I mean, diet-wise, I kind of want to go for the potato. How about the wheat? 10 days. You know what? Let's go for this. Let's go for potatoes. Boom. This guy is going to be our potato guy. I'm going to do a grill going... Like this, maybe? And then we can do... Medium warehouse. Like that. I kind of want to make it look a little bit nicer. So I could have this over here. I could have one more platform. Then having a medium warehouse going this way. I know. <laughs> it's like super pointless. And then we're going to have like a road going underneath this. Could have some water tanks just on, on the shoreline. Yes, 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 yes. Boom, boom. And bada beam. Okay, people are slowly dying. It is, well, it's going to take a while until the harvest. Two people already died. Okay, this is, I would say, a little bit terrible. Uh, we need, we need more crops to be planted. And I think, temporarily, I'm just going to plant those over here, like that. We will have a beautiful path going like so. Come on, come on, get those carrots in. It is a sad day in Beaverton. We lost about nine beavers to famine. I think I've fixed the situation, but the drought is approaching again. Ugh, okay, this kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Hopefully this will solve the, our issues. Can you just focus on harvesting, please? Harvest. You as well, please. If we can harvest, well, they're not going to be harvested, but those guys might might even come into age. I don't think we're going to have issues with, with food. Not 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 this uh, drought. But there's a lot of carrots. Which will be wasted. All those carrots. But we have, like, I mean, we had 44, we have 38, so we only lost a few ones. But the baby making is in full effect. I'm just thinking like, okay, let me just see here. If I would research this, don't do it, I'm doing it. How does that then work? Oh, okay, so it's kind of like one of those bypass... Uh, what are you going to call it? Bypass a road scenarios, right? So if I would do this, that, I'm going to do one of those like this. Hmm. I'm not sure I can place those on, on... Yeah, I guess I can. On water, right? So I do this. Get a path going over here. And then get one of those. Like that? You might be... But, but why, Kralis? Well, the thing is that if we would place some of the windmills over here, they could be powering this all year round. So we could be making planks. Winter time. Or drought time, that is. Look at us! No gears! But... Hmm... Who does the gears? Is that a gear maker? Oh, okay. Let's, let's, I guess, unlock this guy. And we need to place him just over here, right? Because... Otherwise, we can't make those gears. So if you place it that here, it's gonna be... Yeah, it's gonna be waste. Ay, 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 ay. Well, it is what it is. Let's get rid of those guys. And then we just get the gear guy over here. Get all those gears made. Get that. Get the wind turbines over here in the far end. We're just having like a wind turbine over here. Oh, oh, you know what? I was thinking about having the... What you call it? The wind turbines in this vicinity... But maybe that is that is unnecessary because we could delete those and get a wind turbine going here. So that's gonna be a situation over here. It doesn't have to do a lot, as long as it just does a little bit. And prioritize building of this. So do we have any planks remaining? Not nothing. We'll still need to wait, I guess. Until this drought is over. 
and the community of Beaverton has bounced back like never before. Should we have more of those water tanks here? Don't do it. I'm doing it. For the moment, okay? For the moment. We'll see how, the, how where this takes us. But such a fantastic little game. But ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching the first episode in this series. It's nerve-wracking, okay? Because I don't want my beavers to die. And so far, well, they died a little bit, but, but they have bounced back. So hopefully next drought, everything should be amazing. I'm a little bit worried about the food situation, because obviously they, they're reproducing like Irish over here. And I'm not sure I'm keeping up with the food. But, but we have quite a bit of berries here, here, over here. All that those carrots and those potatoes over here. Do we have any more? Okay, grilled potatoes is being depleted as we speak. But if we can just harvest like twice each season between the droughts, we should be good. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much. Look at my beavers. No, 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 no. Uh, how do I? There we go. They're just amazing. I do love the art style. It's a little bit like foundation. The game, that is. We need more stuff for them as well. Like, so far they don't have nothing. Maybe we could do the showers. Okay, that's going to come in next episode. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Kiralis. I'm leaving you from the, the beautiful Beaverton. And let's just wait for day, I guess. Ah, an early morning has broken. What is this guy complaining about, by the way? Ew. Oh, yeah, we removed that little teeth grinder. Okay, since he's working over here in the chopping in business industry, let's get one of those guys going for him. Uh, where is it about? Well-being. And the grindstone will be situated just, just over here. So once going to work, he can just stop over here, get his teeth grinded, and everything is going to be perfect. But did I say goodbyes? Yes, I did. Thank you so much for watching. Hit the like button if you did enjoy. Leave some feedback in the comment section. Tips, tricks, suggestions are more than welcomed. And I will see you guys in the next episode of Harvest Season of Timberborn.